I'm Mike and this is Bluntschli and you're listening to Counting Crows in the background but that's not important right now. What's really important is that you meet some of the people who are managing our cafe at St Columns. Yeah, I, I love being here. I've you know, always lived kind of in the area. I love our clientele. Um, obviously V and Yaz are amazing people to work with. The best boss I've ever had, but he is always late. <laughs> He's always late. Uh, actually, I was, I was sort of self-taught. I started off um, just kind of at a lower level working in a restaurant that had a coffee machine. I'd jump on and make some coffees and then I, my skills kind of developed from there. Um, when I realised that I did want to get more into it and become more knowledgeable, I actually put myself through an intensive course at Proud Mary, uh, which taught me a heap. Uh, really refined my skills and taught me more about specialty coffee, which is great because obviously that's, that's what we offer here, so it's really good to be knowledgeable about that kind of yeah, stuff. Yeah, so yeah. Very fussy and you've got to stay up to date. You know, I, I couldn't believe actually how much science was behind coffee. Stay up to date with all the trends, you know, they're constantly coming out with different <laughs> things. Golden it's crazy. Milk. The turmeric latte has really taken off. I think that's that's a bit of a, a favourite among uh, among the mums that come in. I reckon it will be that and chai. My favourite thing on the menu. I love the mushrooms and eggs. Okay. I mean, I've yeah, you've been at this church more often than most of our regular parishioners have been <laughs> at this church. Because uh -huh. you've been involved with SPL. I have. Yes. Cricket. How many years have you been involved with SPL? It's been I think like, I was, I'm pretty sure I was here game two, was game two, season one was, <laughs> oh, wow. was my first game you here. First game. I did miss the first game for whole very good reasons to be honest. Firstly, it's a, the building itself is a beautiful, beautiful building and it, it deserves something, you know, something with a bit of character as well. Uh, plus, I think it's a great, like SPL is and, and, and the church is, it's a, a way of getting the community involved. So I've had that one for about four years yeah. and I had a little coffee bar in Preston before that for about two years. Right. So I've pretty much been in coffee and hospitality for most of most of my working life. Most of your life. Yeah, most of my life. <laughs> 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 All right, now due to the ultra high secrecy under which this cafe operates, we can't actually show you the chef's face. <laughs> uh, you told me that you made all the decisions about the menu. Yes, I did. Okay, so tell us about the menu. What's special about it? Why did you choose the things that you chose? Um, I just tried to do things a bit differently from what's happening in the area already. Yep. Uh, so our breakfast dishes are a little bit eclectic. Not your normal avocado on toast. Yep. Um, I use a lot of fermentation process, so there's lots of pickles and um, local ingredients on there. We use like, all of our herbs from the garden out the back. Yep. Lots of reasons, Mike, but you know, funny person thinks he's funny. Yes. Can make a good coffee. And that's funny, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Funny. yeah. 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 Can make a good coffee. Yeah. Um, very loyal. Wants the same things as I do in life. Very generous. Extremely good looking. Uh, <laughs> um, my dad's actually a French pastry chef, pastry chef by trade. So as I was growing up, we came from Hobart and he had a patisserie there. So I actually worked there as well from whenever I could. Um, yeah, so I have had exposure to hospitality my whole life as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but now I am an operations manager for a company called Extend that runs before and after school care. Yep. So that keeps me pretty busy. Customers at the cafe, what's, what's your initial reaction to the coffee? Peter, you're an expert on the coffee. It's good. It's good. Sweet. It's sweet? Yeah, yeah. Not too bitter. Okay. I love it. I'll definitely come back. Cookies are good. Is he treating you okay? He is. He is. He Married is. life's going fine. Yes. He's got nothing to do with the cafe. I'm just <laughs> a pastor, I want to know. Otherwise